I think it's tremendous that uh, Governor Kasich carried Ohio. I think that um, it'll uh, really propel his campaign from this point forward. Uh, and it gives him a real chance at the convention. So uh, it's very exciting. I'm very positive, very excited. Um, I hope that this will call attention to his message more so than it has. Um, I'm thrilled to see all the cameras behind me, and it seems like some of them are from around the world, too. So finally his message might be getting out. I think he's going to pick up a lot of momentum. Yeah, that's what will put him on the map. I mean, Trump is still the odds-on favorite, but uh, Kasich is, uh, you hear him speak, he speaks well, and he speaks uh, very intelligently. So, no, I think I think a lot of people will start, will start to listen and stop. We're very, very excited because um, Kasich is, uh, is, is very, is be very good for the country. He is uh, good on the budget and uh, economy, education, there's a lot of things. Uh, security, it's a lot of things that I think what he would be good in. So. I have to admit, when I first heard that Kasich had won, I was a little surprised because, you know, Trump has been getting, it seems that Trump's been getting all the support recently. Yeah. But I like Kasich because he has a lot of experience in the political spectrum as opposed to Trump. That's not to say that Trump doesn't have a few good ideas, but I just believe Kasich is the best for the job. I'm inspired with this. I, I think that he is uh, the right person for the job at this time. He's got the right experience. He has proven that he is uh, a person who's going to bring everybody together. He's not going to be trying to divide anybody in any way, shape, or form. And um, I think he's done a good job with the state to prove what he can do. Um, I'm definitely really excited about Kasich. Um, I've been looking for, you know, someone who can represent young conservatives um, going at a liberal institution. Um, as a freshman right now, I'm really grateful that Kasich gives us a voice, um, and I think he does the best job at that. So. I'm really excited to be here, and I'm so glad that um, John took the state of Ohio and all 66 delegates. Um, I think he's ran a really good, clean, respectable campaign. I think he's the man for the job, and I think if anyone can get it done and get back here to Cleveland in um, over the summer, he's the one to do it. I feel like he's really level-headed and makes good decisions, and I'm hoping that he'll be able to make sure that America's great for me when I am an adult myself and living and having my own children and making sure that they're living in a great America. I mean, granted he's still a politician, uh, you only trust it with a grain of salt, but for the most part what he's done for Ohio in itself, wherever you stand, it's been good. Um, it's better than where I moved from, uh, so I get it, so that's why I'm aboard. I'm glad that he overperformed by 5% and some other candidate underperformed by 5%. Number two, I think now that we now have a three-man race and everybody that's been laughing at Kasich is going to find out that he's running his race, as he said, we're coming to the Midwest, which is my country. Well, I'm actually a Democrat crossing over to vote for Kasich in this election um, because I'm really... Uh, fearing that if the American people kind of continue to play with fire, that this can lead and kind of cycle into a place that we don't necessarily want. So when we think about the protests turning violent and other campaigns, I was really worried about that. So I crossed over to kind of support a candidate that I felt could bring the country together. What if John Kasich so Donald Trump would not win Ohio? Fairly simple, straight to the point, he's a great much better as a candidate, but that's why.